Hello Wolfpack, this is video number 24. In this video, I'd like to discuss the recent upgrades to my EDC. In this video, I will be talking about the Max Maxpedition FR1, which I recently purchased. The pouch came with this tag, as well as this one. It was purchased from a company called Urban Outback on the North New South Wales coast. It took approximately five weeks to deliver. This is the seventh week and it's the first opportunity that I've had to make this video. What I eventually plan on making this uh, pouch into is something like this. This is I actually purchased two pouches. Um, this is the one that I do carry on my hip. Uh, for an overview of this pouch, there are many videos on the internet which will far better describe this uh, describing this pouch than I could ever. But for simplicity's sake, you've got the Velcro on the front where you can attach flags, similar to this one. You've got a tuck away area at the top which runs all the way through. You've got molly webbing on the front the sides and the back, which you can use to attach torches or additional pouches as I've done here. As well as clips on the back in case you want to carry it. The pouch on the inside is a clamshell design has uh, lots of straps in order to attach and hold items within the pouch. You have mesh netting on one side of the clam as well as a zipper on the other. Uh, at the bottom you have a drainage hole Now this pouch is uh, very deceiving it looks, when I was doing my research online, it was, it was quite large or it appeared to be quite larger than what it is when it arrived and I'm really grateful that it didn't come too big. Uh, if, you, if you want a general comparison, if you take an ordinary coffee cup and you put it side by side, right? so that's one co coffee cup length and there's another. So it's about two coffee cup uh, widths long or high. Um, and one and a half coffee cups, or maybe maybe two, one and a half from side to side. So don't be deceived by uh, by the video or by other people's review and think it's really really big. You know, you want to. It, it's it's honestly a really perfect size for a hip pouch. Um, one of the reasons why I purchased this pouch is to carry a number of everyday items. For example, uh, titanium cutlery. Could you imagine the amount of uh, plastic spoons and forks that you would save the environment if you just carried them with you on your hip? Uh, that's one of the reasons why I'm carrying this. I will be purchasing uh, those type of equipment soon, but right now, I had to save up for these and the other equipment. I will be doing uh, additional videos on these pouches which are attached to it as well as the ties in order to attach them to the pouch. Now this, the video on these has already been done. It was a previous video to this, video number 23. If you have any questions or comments please leave them below. Um, as far as weight, I, it's, it's, it's fairly light. I mean, I can't say it's heavy. Uh, but if you, if you have any questions or comments that I can answer about this pouch, let me know. I don't make any promises to respond straight away, but I do promise that I'll make my best effort to respond at some point. Uh, thanks, leave your comments below, and good luck.